Hey there y'all. I just wanted to jump on and show you all of our page types. Uh, we see pre-save page and music release page uh, used most often. The pre-save page is going to be for when a release is going to be coming out in the next couple weeks, next couple months, and you want to start building awareness for that project. Um, you can create a pre-save page. Currently, we have pre-save functionality with Spotify, Apple, Deezer, Tidal, and Amazon Music. On the day that the music is released, the pre-save page will automatically turn from a pre-save page into a music release page. So instead of it saying pre-add, pre-save, uh, pre-order, it will move into active um, verbs, stream now, listen here, stream today, that sort of thing. Uh, music release page is for when the music is already released. You can actually just plug in a UPC and we will auto-populate the page for you. Timed release um, is going to be outside of the pre-save pages, uh, but it is when, um, before the music has been released, you want to set up a page, um, but it can't quite be a music release page, so you will actually set up the time um, and the date with all the release details for when that music is going to go live, um, and on that day and time, this page will turn for you. Uh, basic page, uh, this would be more for like your link and bio style pages. Um, you will manually build this out. It's our basic template. So you can add all of the buttons that you want customizable. You can add all of the social links that you want customizable. That sort of thing. Social Unlock um, was created to entice a fan to take an action. So we have this for YouTube, Spotify, and Apple. Um, and the Social Unlock would be if you follow this Spotify um, artist then you can also have them, when they uh, follow through with that action, it will also unlock them being added to a Spotify playlist, um, so on and so forth for YouTube as well. The Lifetime Presave page is something that we just created uh, recently. And the best part about it is that you can have a presave date as far in the future um, as possible. You don't actually have to have a release upcoming. This is great for in between album cycles um, or you know when you're waiting to figure out when the next release is going to be. Um, you can set up this lifetime pre-save page and anytime a fan uh, pre-saves for the lifetime pre-save page, anytime an artist releases music, um, that music will be added into their library. 